Um, at this time, if we could have the children come up uh, for our children's message. We have Elliot and all the girls. All right, very good today. Welcome, everyone. How are we doing? Good? Good? Now, I have another word for you. A word that you can impress your friends with. Who likes to impress their friends? Raise your hand. I don't know. I know. It's not really a big deal. It might get be a big deal when you're older. But uh, today, this word is, is uh, you know, you might have some of these in your life. It's a difficult word to say. Any PH word is tough to say. What does that say right there? Is it, it's a tough one. What does that say, you think? Phobia? Oh, good. Yeah, that's right. Phobia. Phobia. What's it, what does phobia mean? Does anyone know what phobia means? Another word for phobia is fear, right? So, like, uh, my favorite movie when I was little was this movie called Arachnophobia. Arachnophobia. Now, phobia means what again? It means fear. Arachnid is spider. So that means the movie was about spiders. Who loves... Actually, I think Valerie likes... You like spiders, right, Valerie? Oh, no, you don't? I hear you like lizards. You like lizards, though? Yeah, you like... Yeah, I'm not so much of a lizard guy myself. I don't really go there. I run away, usually. Snakes, no thanks. But... Jesus says in our gospel reading today, he says, have no fear. Now, why does Jesus say that? You know, I don't know what you're scared of. When I was your age, I'll tell you the truth, it wasn't just spiders, but I was always afraid of the dark. So it always, you know, in my room, I know this is, I'd always have a nightlight <laughs> in my room because I was always afraid of the dark. Now, what are you afraid of? I know we always have those things that we're afraid of. Maybe it's the dark. Maybe it's... No. Oh, you guys are not afraid of anything. Probably the dark. The dark. I know me too, right? I love to have the little nightlight on. And, you know, Jesus says, have no fear. He's saying, don't be afraid. Why does Jesus say, don't be afraid? Why do you think? Why does Jesus say, have no fear? Because he is with us at all times. That's right. He is with us at all times. Have no fear. What did Jesus do? Or what was he going to do for them? He was going to die on the cross for their sins. And three days later, they would rise. Jesus would rise from the dead to give them everlasting life. Our greatest fear is our sin and death. And Jesus is saying, no need to fear, because I've come to the world to die for you, to rise for you, to wash away all your sins. And that's who you are. Because of it, children of God. So have no fear this day, because Jesus, as our great Holly would say, is with us at all times. That's right. Let us pray. Dearly Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for these children. Bless them in your word, knowing that by your word, your promise, your truth, you have given them eternal life, forgiveness, and that you have saved them from all things. Bless them and keep them this day and lead them always by your word. We pray all this in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. All right, kids. Bye.